Hey guys, this is Tyler up at the Finley Ewing Fitness Center. I'm going to take you through a quick dumbbell workout. All you'll need is two dumbbells. You can use two jugs of water or two cans, anything you have around the house, and a chair is optional. I'm going to start off with lateral raises. You're going to start with your arms off to the side, raising them up out next to you. Remember to keep your core tight. Think about pressing your elbows out, not bringing the dumbbells up. We're going to do three sets of 12 reps. That's going to be with all exercises today, so you'll do 12, rest, repeat three times. Next, we'll move into bicep curls. We're going to start with a hammer curl, so palms facing each other, keeping that core tight, elbows right next to you. You should feel this in the front of your arm, maybe a little bit in the forearms. Again, three sets of 12. Next, we'll move into squats. So you'll uh, start off weights up underneath the chin, feet about shoulder width apart. Think about driving the knees out, hips back, keeping that core tight and your chest up. Complete 12 reps. Rest, repeat three times. Remember with this one, if you start to feel it in your back, maybe move over to a chair. Next, we'll do side bends. So this is a core exercise. You'll start with one dumbbell on one side and you'll tilt over to the other or the side with the dumbbell, keeping that core activated. Remember with this one to keep up tall. You don't want to start to feel it in your lower back. If you do, you're not engaging your core properly. So think about your posture, shoulders back, neck up. Next, we'll move into a front raise, so the, the another shoulder exercise, so starting with the dumbbells in front of you. Again, thinking about pushing the elbows out versus bringing the dumbbells up, keeping the core engaged, neck relaxed, 12 reps. Next, we'll move into a tricep kickback. So you want to be hinged over at the hips, dumbbells in both hands, elbows up high pressing the back head of the dumbbell up into the sky. You should feel this in your triceps or the back of your arm. Next, we'll move into a different kind of bicep curl. This one's just a standard bicep curl. So now you'll pom your palms will be facing up. Again, keeping the elbows right by the side. You don't want to let them come off. Keeping up tall, core engaged. On this exercise, go ahead and breathe, when you come, breathe out when you come up and when you go down. Next, we'll move into rows. So again, a hinge at the hips. You don't want to be bent over at the back. You'll notice I have a flat back on this, bringing the dumbbell up to the hip. Next, we'll do knee up. So this is a core exercise. With this, you want to keep from swaying as much as possible, a dumbbell in each hand. You're going to bring the knees up to about hip level, doing 12 reps each side. And that was a 10-minute dumbbell workout.